New tonight, the Palm Beach County School Board met this afternoon and voted to expel nine students for one year, seven of them for weapons violations. Contact five investigator Dave Bowman's been looking into all of this and this ends a year a school year where a record number of students have been kicked out of school bringing weapons to campus. Dave. Michael Shannon, the number of students expelled in Palm Beach County for bringing weapons to class doubled in the recently ended school year compared to the last school year. About eight times a year, the Palm Beach County School Board meets to approve recommendations to expel students. At an afternoon meeting, nine students were to be considered for a one-year expulsion, seven for bringing weapons to campus. Behind closed doors, school board members have access to information like the name of the school, the weapon used, and the circumstances under which the kid brought a weapon to school. But that information is not listed on the public agenda. Contact 5 crunched the numbers by looking at school board agendas over the past five years. This school year, Palm Beach County Schools voted to expel 42 students for weapons violations. That doubles more than any other year in the past five school years. The numbers from the 2021 school year artificially low because COVID kept students at home with online learning. These numbers might worry parents with reports of school mass shootings around the U.S. televised into living rooms almost weekly. But an expert on school violence has a different take on kids involved in school shootings. And the majority of those were not planned attacks like Sandy Hook or Parkland or Uvalde. They were fights that escalated into shootings because a student had a gun with them. David Reedman is the founder of the K-12 school shooting database. His research shows a dramatic rise in school shootings over the past five years. And with four and a half months of school left this year, another record could be set in 2023. The rise in nationwide shootings parallels the rise in students expelled for weapons violations in Palm Beach County schools. According to limited information on some Palm Beach County school board agendas, the weapons students brought to campus include knives, the most common, followed by firearms and tasers. Palm Beach County school officials were unavailable for comment, but as a preventative measure to stem the tide of weapons in school, the district is about to roll out a plan for metal detectors, first in select schools and then district wide. Dave, I'm curious, how does Palm Beach County stack up or measure up to other counties when it comes to expelling students for this issue? That's the question we've been trying to answer, Shannon. And the challenge is if you look at the seven largest school districts in Florida, right. Palm Beach County is the only one that has the transparency really? to go ahead and list it on the school agendas. To get that information to compare to other schools would be a very laborious right huh. to know process.